All right, so um, I guess one of the moments that a shit, not that. I guess one of the moments that a lot of people were waiting for uh, was Bruno Mars doing the Prince uh, tribute. And that was right. um, it was a pretty damn good tribute, even though I thought he should have done a song that oh, would God. catch everybody's ear. I, it's just, it, you know what? Maybe that's just from my um, my perspective. I thought he should have did Purple Rain. Purple Rain, or uh, Why Do Doves Cry? When doves cry. When doves cry, whatever. When dogs cry, fuck. What, whatever the and fuck that song is. That but, like that, right? but, but that that's just me. I thought if he was going to do a tribute, he should have uh, He should have done a bigger song. You know what I mean? That, that, that's all I'm thinking. I, I thought it would have been a better song is for him to um, do a bigger song. Or one that even the casual listener. Now I consider myself a casual listener of Prince. I'm not really, per se, a fan. But there are certain songs that, as soon as it comes on, you know what that song is. And I and I think that's the the true same for any artist. Like there's just certain certain songs you don't have to be a fan. But as soon as that song comes on, you know exactly what that song is, even if you're not a fan of that artist. And I thought if you're going to do a tribute, you should have done one of those songs. That's all I'm saying. But, uh, yeah, a, a hell of a uh, performance from Bruno Mars, especially the guitar solos, um, as he absolutely destroyed those. Um, anyway, folks, uh, we are 28 minutes away uh, from the finish of this show, and I can't wait because I need to crash. I got to be up at 5 o'clock in the morning to get ready to get the hell out of here. I will talk to you guys Next time, I got to get ready to finish up my son's book report. Um, send it off to his teacher. Not like you guys give a damn.